Yes. Two yeah. two hours sleep, I think maybe maybe an hour and a half, two hours. I'm no good. Somebody oh, said it's morning. I mean wouldn't let me go to bed last night. Yeah, Bubba. Hey. It was Bubba who said it's morning. <laughs> Bubba says so, it's morning. Wave. Hey! There's a culprit over there in the corner. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, she yes. is. Hey, she Celine. So, how are you oh, doing? Hey, Celine. Hope you're doing well. Yes. Very well. Adjusting. Reentry. So, next uh, retreat, uh, you are coming. Not you, Keith, but you, Celine, <laughs> <laughs> and Nina. That was so wrong. Sorry. <laughs> Keith, you can come with your wife. <laughs> so. <laughs> Yeah, lack of sleep is going to be really There's interesting not today. Coffee on the planet. <laughs> so here's Jen. Look. Jen, hey. Hi. And Paula. Hey, and there's Paula. Hey. There's Brenda. Nita's on there. Becky, hey, from Uganda. <laughs> Jim Lynn. Becky. Shanna. Shanna and Abby. Hi, Becky. Hey, Nita. Hi, Nita. We Nita's on you. there. Hi. We love you. Hi, Nita. Hey, Nita, we are convinced that you are going to be well by next week. Nita, you're not yes. feeling good? Not. She's feeling better every moment. Uh-huh. Yes. Is Brenda okay? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm okay. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so we, we have these glass doors, and we do such an amazing job at keeping them clean that... <laughs> They, okay, this is my really face. <laughs> yes, everyone keeps saying that it's they, too clean. They because keep walking into them. They keep walking into them. I do. Face. I've done that. It hurts. It'll leave a mark too. Oh, wow. Well, hey, Nancy. Hey, Becky. Hey, when are you coming home? She says she is home. Oh, Becky Ottinger. Hey, hey, girlfriend. Hey, You're I Alabama now. Becky. Yeah. Do you like my necklace? I do, too. It's pretty cool. Yeah. So, um, we're going to have another retreat once a month. So, which one are you coming? Celine and Becky and Nita. Keith, you can have your wife come. Brenda. or um, Hey, for um, the BJ. special case, I can... I can hit you with hey. espresso. So, can. we're having this woman's retreat. Hey, <laughs> Becky, Ottinger, when are you coming to our uh, retreat? It's going to be one in October, or not October, yeah. Um, March. <laughs> hey, <laughs> the two Beckys are on there. Becky and Becky. Uh... Until tomorrow, heading back to Florida. Oh, you're going back to Florida? Seriously? We're going to Florida? Yes. Becky Ottinger, we're going to Florida. Yes. So, um, we'll give you a call. Maybe we can catch up with you next week. Um, we're heading there in a week and a half. Um, so, yes, we're having this amazing retreat. So, you have any testimonies of what God did yesterday? Ha ha. There's... The fearless leader. What's your group name? Daily Devotional Discipleship and Accountability. Uh huh. And she had to get up at six o'clock to be ready at six thirty for a video chat. So I think it's a testimony that we were all here, that we're all able to come and make it. Um, one of our girls, Jessica, has never been able to leave her house. She's got four small children, oh. and it's her first time away. And her car broke down, mm -hmm. and then her son hit his head, had a huge knot, had to go to the emergency room. Her phone broke, but she was still able to come and make it, and there's several testimonies like that, so. Come on. God's just bringing them. <laughs> I think it's awesome that, um, not that we wouldn't love to have lots of women here, but for us to have one of our first retreats, and it ended up just being the people in the group, ends up, is, to me, is, and it's a lot. We, yeah. filled, we filled the whole house, so <laughs> yeah, it's <that's> great. <laughs> <laughs> so you got one of the beds last night. Oh, I love them. Oh, look, look thank oh, you. Gotta have my shoes. Don't worry about them. <laughs> I might steal them. <laughs> hey, how are Hi. you? I'm doing great. So, so what's an amazing my... testimony that you can share with the world? 
Mm. <laughs> I love putting people in this spot. This is Brenda, by the way. That I was just able to get here and that God's good and that he does amazing work and and free. he paid for my hearing aids. It's completely free, which is awesome. That's an amazing and, testimony. And I'm expecting him for a car because I don't have a car. And I'm Seriously? just believing in him. God. Yeah. Hi, uh, hey. So this is <laughs> Shanna? Shanna. Uh, <laughs> I'm learning names. Yay. Yes. So what's a most recent uh, scripture that God has given you? Ooh, <laughs> most recent was actually this morning on Jennifer's live video. <laughs> uh, what was it? For my yoke is easy and my burden is light. Wow. <laughs> and it just fit right in with uh, what God is doing for us. And if we would just give up some, if we would just let him take care of us, he has so much freedom to give Come us. On. There's just so much freedom. And that's what I'm looking forward to. And and receiving it. <laughs> <laughs> so, that is amazing. Thank you so much. Yes, yeah, more of that today. We're going to put people on the spot everywhere. Look at this beautiful view out here, ladies. Lucky. Yes. You can wake up to this when you come to a retreat. Yeah, it's nice. Yeah, there's, I think there's like a diamond up there in the sky. No, it's a reflection from the window. <laughs> <laughs> so we're gonna go out here and we're gonna do some interviewing. Hey, Abby. We got a question for you. Maybe all which, of What's your favorite Bible character? My favorite Bible character. There's so many of them. But that's a good way to buy time. I really like a lot. I'm like, okay, I like Just one. Okay. <laughs> it's just like, too early okay, for you to think of all of them. This morning, it's Elisha. Okay, and why? The shah? <laughs> because... Not the jaw, but the shah. The shah. Shah! Elisha! Shah! Elisha! Just so you know, Facebook Live. <laughs> <laughs> because I'm not awake yet, so I won't remember this. <laughs> But That's right, you can watch it later. <laughs> because he had the like insight to ask for the double portion. He had That's not awesome. seen, there was no like paradigm for that. He had not seen that. Mm -hmm. but he was like bold enough and he was like, I want double, I want twice of what you like have. That you ain't leaving me. <laughs> That's freaking awesome. <laughs> yeah, so how does that relate to your life? <laughs> because you can kill me later. Okay. <laughs> I feel like the Lord has told me so many times not to look around me because hey, he has... Hey, I'm hooking you up because you haven't hit the coffee yet. So. <laughs> oh my gosh. Maybe okay. if I go hide. To not look around to see if something's already been done before because he wants to do a new thing in oh, me. I didn't know that that would and like so just because something too. hasn't been done before doesn't mean... It's not available to me. Not a problem. And so. Yeah, it was. That's pretty awesome. It's pretty good for any two hours sleep. She's doing right? pretty good. That was really good. Yeah, this is the culprit. She's the, kept me up. Yes. Yes, she kept me up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I get a roll out of bed kind of hair, dude. <laughs> so, hey, Tammy. Love you, girl. Hey, you have to come to one of our retreats. So. What are you doing over here? She's getting I'm ready. I'm getting coffee. Yeah. So. And I got it on my phone. So oh like, no. That? That's crazy. Here, yeah. The towel. See? Yeah, we're having oh moments. So I did the coffee in the dark, so I'm hoping it tastes okay. Yeah. <clears throat> we did it with the flashlight off of the cell phone. Oh, thank you. <laughs> so this is Jamie. So Jamie, what is your favorite uh, scripture? Um, it's always been Philippians 4 and 8. Mmm. You know what it is? Well, I can't quote it word for word. That's but okay. It's basically, um, just think on what is true, what is lovely, oh, what is, um, yeah. you know, just what is true, what is lovely. See, I, I told you. That's you put okay. Me on the spot. I can't good. even get to two things. All perhaps. of these things. Think on them. <laughs> yes, yeah. yes. So is there, is there a time that, like, when God gave it to you, that you remember? 
I learned it when, actually, this is really great. So I started in Missionettes, which is a girl's ministry in the Assembly God, and I memorized that mem memory verse. And then when I went through um, my daughter's birth, it was very traumatic. Um, I would, that's the only one that just kept going over and over and over in my head, and just, just to think on God and to think on... The, the things that he has given us and our blessings and everything that's true and everything that's true about her and everything that's lovely about her and just yeah it just got me through her birth oh man that's amazing yeah i'm glad to meet you this weekend i think it's going to be a beautiful friendship yes we're making new friends and it's just awesome. We're going to throw people out of the boat all day. So, I <laughs> was the first one. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> ah, not yet. Ha ha ha. So, what is your This is Edie. Hi. Tammy's on. Oh, hey Tammy. I think the Beckys are on and the Celine. Becky's awesome. And Keith was okay. on. Um um, I'm sorry if I forget names, but anyway, what is the newest revelation that God has given you? It's Heavy not revving. the thing I prepped for. <laughs> <laughs> I okay. know. Okay, so the newest revelation that he's given me, it was actually a, a little bit ago. It wasn't. Coffee? Hey, don't be shooting. <laughs> um, <laughs> it's coffee. <sighs> so Get the, the, newest, the newest revelation is that the first miracle that they say Jesus performed was turning the water into wine at the wedding yes. at Cana. And I believe that the quote last miracle that he wants to do is turning okay, so he took earthen vessels and he used them to have the wine and it was actually water purification vessels. So I believe that he wants to use these earthen vessels, which is us Mm -hmm. And he wants to take the living water that he's put in us and turn it into the new wine, which yes. he pours out mm -hmm. to the people who don't know him yet in order to invite them to the wedding banquet. And so I believe that that's like the, quote, final miracle that he wants to do. Come on. So that's the latest revelation. I love it. Come yeah, somebody on. over there is like catching so it. <laughs> the door, like, yes, Wah! like Abby is getting a little tilt a wheel. <laughs> All right, let me see if we can go find some other people. I think there's, this is, this is our ministry house. We have about 12 to 15 women here this weekend. I think Let's it's 14. See, 14. And they have to do, usually they have it already, but they probably don't since they left the insurance lab. Yeah. Good morning. Good morning. Hey, Facebook Live, oh, Amy. Oh, no. Hi, and there's Brandy. <laughs> Oh, you look lovely. I'm you, here with my tooth brush on my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> so, Brandy, I got a question for you. Okay. What's your favorite Bible character? Hmm. Rahab. Okay. So, why? Because of her boldness uh -huh. and her faith and how her how she overcame. <laughs> So many obstacles I can relate. Come on. That's pretty sweet. Yeah. Yeah. Is there one thing that you can relate to that you want to share to the world? Ooh. No? The dirtiness and yeah. the shame from Just, sexual immorality. Wow. That's cool. And God yeah. Cleansed God all. set me free from all of that. Sweet! Yeah. <laughs> yes. What a testimony. <laughs> yes. You know what? And then the lineage. I mean, she pushed through all of that and then Jesus. Come on. <laughs> you know, so I know I came through so much and and now here I am and I wasn't, I had doctors and people, medical people that said I was not going to be able to have children. Yeah. And now I have the most awesome, beautiful little boy. Yeah. And I know he's a world changer. He's special and Come I on. just kind of feel like. I don't know. I can relate to that. Yeah, that's pretty sweet. Thank you for sharing. You're amazing. Oh, thank you. Yeah. And you just got a boldness and a courage inside of you that, man, the enemy was scared to death that if you get a hold of who you are, he's done. He's done. Yeah. He's done. Yep. So, you ready, Amy?
Yes, yes you are. <laughs> yes. Okay. All right. This is Amy. So Amy, what is let's see, what's the newest revelation that God has given you? That worship is warfare. Like that's mm -hmm. been a big, big thing he's been dealing with me about lately. And um like I've really been like in the throes of of warfare lately anyway and then like he's just really teaching me that that's that's where my power and my strength come from to defeat the enemy mm -hmm. so it's been good like he's given me songs or like or songs that, anything you know, any particular out. testimony uh that you want to share to the world well yeah like i guess um okay so i was at my table and i had this um keyboard that I've had had for like ever. Yeah. Well, actually I'd given it to somebody and they sent it back to me uh -huh. because just they decided they didn't want it anymore. At the right timing. Mm -hmm. And so I was just going to sell it because we didn't need it. Like none of us play the keyboard and my kids, they would just plunk on it and you know, it would be annoying. So anyway, um, so I was going to sell it, but I wanted to make sure it worked. So as I sat down, I started <clears throat> hearing this song. Oh, come on. And so I was like, so I just started singing it. Like, I just started singing out the song. And, like, all of these, like, all of a sudden it was, like, this whole song, like, came out. And I just started, like, warring in the spirit. And I was, like, I don't care what it looks like. I don't care. Like, you know, I'm going to worship you. Anyway, but, like, I felt the spirit, like, fall. And it was, like, there was a connection. Like, I could feel, like, he was intently listening to what mm. I had to say. Come on. And so, like, and then I just started praying you know, for different things that I've been believing God for. And I knew, I like, I literally, like, knew he was hearing me. And so, and he had spoken to me, like, the week before. Mm -hmm. And was like, um, he told me, he said, pray, pray intentionally and I will answer your prayers. And I was like, Lord, I had been praying intentionally. What are you talking about? Mm -hmm. Like, and I'd just been, like, thinking on that for, like, the whole week. Because I was like, I don't understand, like... I thought I had been praying intentionally, you know, but then like I realized that's what I was doing when I was like in that moment with him. It was like there was the actual connection, you oh, know, wow. that I felt with him. Yeah. And so anyway, Come it was on. really good. Sweet, I love it. Ha ha ha. So yes, and this is the beautiful view for those who are interested in coming um, to our next retreat. Hey, Stacy Rhodes, how are you doing? So, we're going to see if there's somebody else up yet. There's a group of them that haven't arose yet from the sleep. So, um, yes, we're having this women's retreat. We're having it in bull shows, and we're believing that we're going to start having one each month. And so, if you're interested in coming, let me know. It is, um, <clears throat> email me at trinolson at radicallaunch.org. And uh, I'm just excited to see what God's doing. And the sun is starting to come up. And there's like a beautiful... Rela Let's see here. Look at this. Look at the reflection. Oh my gosh, look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Ooh. All right. Goodbye, and I'll talk to you guys later. Ciao.